Hello and welcome to the Start Here video for BA 280 Cooperative Work Experience. In this video, I will introduce you to the course and the Blackboard site for the course. First, let's talk about the course, BA 280 Cooperative Work Experience, or CWE, provides an opportunity to get credits while you're gaining valuable work experience. The work experience you obtain can be paid or non-paid, but it must relate to your course of study. Much of the information I'm sharing with you in this video is available on the Blackboard site for the course under course information. Let's, dis let's discuss your responsibility as a student who is registered for C CWE. You are ultimately, re ultimately responsible for searching and finding a suitable CWE job opportunity. You were also responsible for submitting the required forms and assignments in Blackboard. As your CWE advising faculty, I will provide direction and encouragement as you prepare for and seek a CWE opportunity. I will also provide prompt feedback to your questions and concerns throughout the term. Finally, I will meet your CWE job supervisor sometime during the term. Your CWE job supervisor or work supervisor is required to provide an evaluation of your work at the end of the term and confirm your hours worked throughout the term. Here is what you need to accomplish during the first couple of weeks of the term. First, contact me. Uh, to set up a time to discuss your CWE job opportunity. We can meet in person, via the internet, or over the phone. If you already have one set, uh, if you already have one set up, then we will initiate the CWE agreement form. The CWE agreement form in all forms can be found under the forms area on the Blackboard site. If you have not found a CWE job opportunity, we will discuss your options and make a plan to get you one. This may include polishing up your resume and making a list of businesses for you to contact. Next, you need to have your CWE job supervisor sign the CWE agreement. And then you need to submit it in Blackboard in the assignments area. Now let's discuss uh, what you need to do during the term. Depending on how many credits of CWE you registered for, you need to schedule and work the appropriate hours. You must work 36 hours for each credit. You must record this and your progress on the CWE timesheet. It can also be found in the forms area on the Blackboard site. Your CWE sup job supervisor should initial the weekly entries and confirm the final amount on the form. This form must then be submitted using the submission link in the assignments area of Blackboard. Now at the end of the term, you need to have your CWE supervisor complete your CWE evaluation and finalize the CWE timesheet. These forms are then submitted in Blackboard. You must also submit a term paper describing your CWE experience and submit it to Blackboard as well. Under the course information area of Blackboard, there are documents to assist you in answering your questions and the questions of your job supervisor. Please read and study these documents to assist you as you begin the course. I'm looking forward to having you in a CWE Cooperative Work Experience course this term. Please feel free to call me or email me or come by my office anytime and uh, ask questions if you run into troubles and we'll help you out. So thank you and have a good day.